Well, a family in Cleveland, Tennessee is battling a parent's worst fear, a child's cancer diagnosis. Five-year-old Olivia Weatherford is fighting stage floor four neuroblastoma. Well, their extended family, friends, and the entire community have surrounded them with support over the past two months since the diagnosis. Channel 3's Allison Pryor found out how the community has gotten involved. Olivia Weatherford, also called Liv, is fun, lively, and spunky. She has two loving parents, Aaron and Sarah, and a younger sister and brother, Ella and Eli. She was first diagnosed with cancer at the beginning of April with initial testing at the Children's Hospital at Erlanger. St. Jude came back accepting their case, which doesn't always happen, and, and they did accept their case. The whole family packed up and moved to Memphis for Olivia's treatment. What Olivia is facing is very difficult and very hard for any child. So far, she has maintained strong spirits. To help the Weatherfords, people back at home in Cleveland are stepping up to offer support. There is a trust fund through Bank of Cleveland to which anyone can donate for Olivia, a GoFundMe page and an Amazon registry. They've said many times is just how overwhelmed they are with the love and the support. The newest activity is a fundraising race happening at Greenway Park in Cleveland on Saturday, June 1st at 8.30 a.m. Cleveland is an active community and so we were trying to think of something to get people involved and bring a lot of people together and also raise funds. So uh, we came up with the idea of a 5k and family one mile. They currently have about 330 people signed up and there is still more time to get involved. All funds raised through the race registration go to the Weatherfords. It's helping them so much. They really do feel the love and that's what we want for this event is most importantly to just bring as many people together so that they can see visually how many people are thinking of them and supporting them. Festivities will last from 8.30 a.m. to 3 p.m. If you can't make it on Saturday, Bethany McCoy said one of the best ways you can support Olivia is by sending a letter. She loves going to the mailroom and, and having cards and letters and pictures to look at. And uh, I would definitely just encourage people to send her letters of encouragement as well as her mom and dad. You can follow along on Olivia's path through her Facebook page called Live in the Journey. We have a link to it and their mailing address at St. Jude inside the WRCB app. Reporting in the studio, Allison Pryor, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.